This 18-hole golf course, located in the Middle East, is likely to be the first Trump-connected property to open following the president-elect's inauguration. The Trump International Golf Club will be managed by Trump Organization employees. It's set inside a massive real estate project called Akoya, created by the Dubai-based luxury developer, DeMac Properties. The Trump Organization being one of the biggest and best developers in New York, and DeMac being one of the biggest and best developers in Dubai in this region, there was obviously synergies, and Mr. Trump and our founder, Mr. Sajwani, knew each other personally for over 10 years uh, from their real estate background. But the business synergy between the two companies is something that troubles this attorney, who works for the Project on Government Oversight, a nonprofit that's a government watchdog. President-elect Trump has blurred the line between his public service role as the president-elect, what his transition team is doing, and what his business operations are. A Federal Election Commission report submitted last May indicates Trump has already received between one and five million dollars from DeMac. The company's spokesman declined to offer specifics, but admits the outcome of the election has given a boost to business. The fact that he's won the election has increased the interest in this development, and as, as I stated, the brand has become stronger because of it, and we're very, very pleased with that. A second big concern, security. Donald J. Trump is Trump's call for a ban on Muslims entering the U.S. and later his proposal for extreme vetting of immigrants sparked regional anger. The Trump logos on the golf course even came down for a while. And I would think any of these buildings around the world are also going to have to ha ramp up their own personal security as well because there may be some security concerns as people may want to act out against uh, the president. Dubai is one of the safest cities in the world uh, under the leadership of His Highness Sheikh Mohammed and uh, all the other ro uh, royal members. Dubai has proved itself to be safe. We have no extra concerns about this, uh, this golf course. The course is Trump's first ongoing real estate venture in the Arab world, but not the last. A second Trump-managed golf course is planned for an even larger DeMac project, now under development not far from here. Ned Barker, Associated Press.